Come on down to Wild West. Meat market. They grill for you Friday, Saturday, Sunday. From 12 to 6. All you gotta do is leave a tip. And they'll get you right. Welcome back to another episode of Forks Ready. I'm Shane. And I'm Michael. And today we're down here at... The Carniceria. Wild West. We have our great co-owner, Yami, who's gonna take us on a journey, tell us a little bit about the place, and show us a good time. So check out how the West was won. Let's go. Martinez. Um, I am part ownership of Wild West Carniceria um, here in uh, Tucson, Arizona. So in 2014, we opened El Novio. Uh, we were there uh, for a couple years. We did struggle, but it was good. Um, once it started skyrocketing, we bought uh, another establishment on 29th and Craycroft. Um, it's called Los Vaqueros. Um, and then a couple years later, we opened up here, Wild West Meat Market. Um, it has been great experiences we've been here so far. Uh, so what makes us unique is the flavorful that we bring uh, to, to our community. Uh, we make everything you know, fresh from chorizo, we make our own marinades, uh, we make our own aguas frescas, our salsas, our beans. Oh, we even have a bakery. We even have a bakery in for you guys. So another great thing that we bring in the community is that we grill for free, Fridays, Saturdays, and Sundays between 12 to 6 on our really great grill outside. you guys to try our one of our grilling packages um, it offers uh, meat uh, it has beans rice sauces uh, tortillas and we'll have it grilled outside for you guys um, can I get a pack number one please now what's really nice about grilling pack number one is that it serves three to five people. Which definitely makes sense considering it is two pounds of skirt steak. Now that we've placed our order, it's time to go check out the grill. In addition to the skirt steak, they are also grilling us some onions. All right, so today we're gonna try their pack number one, their grilling pack number one. And what's interesting, what we see, there's some uh, fresh onions grill. They gave us some of their skirt steak. We got, some, we got some salsa, some guac. We got some rice. We have some beans and even some fresh tortillas. And we also uh, grabbed a few of their drinks. It's fresh agua frescas that they make here. So we're looking forward to trying this food. Yes, sir. I'm looking forward to trying this. Never had it before. It is in house, made in house. That was Jamaica. Yeah. We got the Jamaica, and then yeah. right here we have the uh, sandia. And then is that one the horchata? Yeah, there. So horchata. The horchata. Nice. And all this stuff is made fresh. In house. We're getting all set up. As you know, sometimes it's a setup, getting everything ready, but we're in it to win it. 
All right, guys, so what you see is we put a little bit of the pico de gallo, some of the guacamole, have some of the meat in here. This meat is very tender. Mm. Yeah, very tender, very tender, and it was, um, it's marinated, so it definitely has a lot of, a lot of flavor when you bite into it. First time trying agua fresca. I'm gonna try this out, man. Oh yeah. It's good, it's refreshing, it's real refreshing. It has a lot of different ingredients in it. Rice, water, milk, cinnamon, and sugar. And none of each ingredients has balance to it. So I like it, man. I like it. This is my first time trying anything like this. I'm used to drinking Kool-Aid or Mini Maid juice. So to get some fresh juice, I ain't never had no drink made from rice. I didn't even know you could make a drink from rice. Hey, so I recommend it. Come down to the Wild West Meat Market. And you can get you one of these. All right, in addition to the food, like Shane was saying, these agua frescas are amazing. I have the sandia one. Uh, they have some amazing grilled vegetables. We were kind of talking about that a little bit. They have some of the uh, grilled onions. Definitely worth checking out. Fresh tortillas, uh, fresh pico de gallo, fresh guacamole. This is the place you got to come to. So if you're curious about trying some meat or maybe even want them to cook your meat for you, this is the place where you got to go. good um, and I want them to try everything homemade that I have to offer. I want every person that comes into that door to leave feeling like family. I want to give a special thank you to Yami for having us today. Thank you for letting us try some of your delicious food, your amazing agua frescas. Hey, and another episode of Forks Ready is complete. You ready for that next one? Make sure like, comment, and subscribe. Um, it was great working with you guys because, um, I don't know, you guys helped me out, you know, with all the interviews and stuff. Um, you guys have a good vibe, and I like that. Thank you for choosing us, actually. <laughs> um, thank you for noticing us. It, it really means a lot, for sure. Marinated. Um, oh, so that's my dad's uh, newest invention. It's uh, called uh, Wild West, uh, what is it? Yeah. Smoke rub. Yeah. <laughs> that's good, huh? That's good, really good. He just made it. <laughs> Want some more? Come on, take today, it. Take today, it, yeah. Today was the first day he made it. <laughs> yeah, it's the first day. He's trying to sell his CC. Take it, no problem. <laughs> okay. Hold that. Hold that right here. No, it's much sauce. Much sauce. Yeah. Like, <laughs> you like it you put, it in a, put it in another plate.
Yeah or no? Yes? Are you sure? We got something. We got something.